Hey everybody, in today's video, I'm gonna show you how to set up activity alerts on your Garmin Instinct 2X Solar Watch. This is pretty similar to other Garmin watches out there. Most of them are going to have this feature. This is also a setting you could do in the Garmin Connect app and set it all up and then simply sync the changes over to your watch. So what are we talking about with activity alerts? These alerts are per activity. So for example, if you're going out and you're doing a jog and you wanna get alerted when certain things occur, maybe you've gone a certain distance, a mile, Maybe you're hit, you've hit a certain pace, your heart rate's hit a certain level. You can set it so the watch will alert you when those things happen during that giving activity. And that's what we're going to be doing here. There's a couple different ways to go about going into this setting. I'm going to do it probably the harder way, which is go like you're going to do the activity and set up the setting. The easier way is just to go in and do the settings before doing the activity, but they're all going to take you to the same place. I'll press the GPS button. We need a good example here. This is going to be my listings of activities. Again, this setting does not impact all of the activities, just the certain one you're looking to change. Let's go into the walk activity. I'm going to press GPS to choose the walk activity. Once you go into the activity, you're going to see this little icon up here that says options and it's got an arrow pointing up. If I press the up button, that will take me into my activity settings. And this is where I was saying you can get to this multiple different places. The first thing we see is walk settings. I'm going to press GPS to choose walk settings. And if we press the down button, the second option we see is alerts. So these are going to be alerts for whenever we do the walk activity in my example. Press GPS. You'll notice I don't have any alerts currently set up. I can choose to add a new one. There's some predefined ones, and then you can also create a custom one. I'll come back and show you the custom one. I want to show you some of the predefined ones. A heart rate alert, time alert, distance alert, cadence alert, calories alert, elevation alert, proximity. So let's just choose one of these. Calories is a pretty good example. If I press the GPS button, I can set an alert once I've done my walk activity and I've burned at least 200 calories, give me an alert. Every 200 calories I burn, the watch will alert me. The alert settings will follow whatever your default settings are in your uh, settings, whether that's a tone, vibration, or a silent alert, or a tone and a vibration. That's just an example. You can set multiple alerts. So we've got our calorie, calorie alert set up. Let's add a new one. We can go in and again, we've got the same options we saw before. Maybe you want to have an alert. Uh, you wanna go out and do a walk once it's been 30 minutes. That's your goal every day. I wanna do a 30 minute walk. Once it's been 30 minutes, give me an alert you just set a time alert. So now the way I've got mine set up, when I go do the walk activity, every 30 minutes, the watch will alert me. And every time I burn 200 calories, the watch will alert me. I'm gonna go do add a new one just to show you another option. Let's do custom just so you can see the different options in there. You can have a different message that comes up whenever the alert goes off. For example, drink, eat, turn around, go home, or you can set a custom message. Um, let's do go home. When does it alert me that I need to go home? You can either do it based on time or distance. Let's do distance and let's say once I've gone 1.5 miles, tell me I need to go home. That's basically what an activity alert does. I'm going to go ahead and go back. Let's get out of the walk activity and let's go down to a different activity. Let's choose the hunting activity. Again, this setting is per activity. So if I press the up button to go into my settings, oh, I have to wait until the GPS connects. Actually, let me go to a different activity where we don't have to wait for GPS. Let's do tennis because I have the GPS turned off. You'll notice if I go into my tennis settings and I go to alerts, there's none set because again, the alerts are per activity. It's pretty cool. In my case, when I do a hunting activity, I don't care necessarily about distance. Maybe I care about things like uh, heart rate or something like that. Uh, whereas when I'm walking, I care more about distance than if I'm hunting. Anyway, that's a quick look at how you can set alerts per activity on the Garmin Instinct 2X Solar Watch. As always, I hope the video helps. If it does, I appreciate thumbs up. Thanks for watching.